I still maintain my stand that no Almajiri will be accepted in River State. Governor Unyesom declared, I will, start, I will maintain my stand no matter what. No Almajiri will be accepted in River State. River State and other parts of Eastern and Southern Nigeria are not a dumping refuge for the North. Did you even see how they packaged those Almajiris? Some of them were eating under cows and covered with blankets. And someone in Abuja will be there, ordering us to accommodate some such people in our state. How possible is that? How many Easterners or Southerners have we packaged and sent to the North before? Of course, that is not in our blood. Let them burn how many they are or they can train, period. Besides, we don't have the resources to take care of them. Perhaps, who knows their plans? We don't know what their plans are and we don't want to know. Thank you for viewing and listening to this news. Viewers, you have heard from the mouth of um, consigning the rejection and rejecting Almajiris from entering into the state. Now, Unyesom has um, sent so many um, of his members, of his um, guards, to different angles in the states to block every angles so that the Amajuris will not have access in, to enter this, um, their state. And it's very, very acceptable. I love what he did. I like it so much. It's a man. I'm so much proud of Mwiki Unisom. If other states can stand on their ground on this, then this country will be a better place. If the, 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 the government have, uh, decides or decide on this or uh, um, have this kind of stand or kind of decision, in this country, I see no reason why um, Nigerians will be affected by this COVID-19. The pressing China, Chinese that brought this COVID-19 into this country wouldn't have succeeded in doing that because there is free entry and free exit in the country. This is why um, uh, these Chinese people succeeded in bringing, in entering and bringing this virus to this country. And we are very angry with our government. If we, as I've said before, I said, if we in Kenya some where it is to, where to be or is our government, our president, we would have been, there would have been so much discipline in the state, in the country, sorry to say. A lot of people are so proud of Nike Winnison for his decisions concerning this COVID-19 throughout uh, this lockdown in the state. I so much appreciate him for his hard work. During these two weeks lockdown, he has been up and doing. He has been making sure, he has always made sure that there is security in the area, in the street, in the state, he made sure that the people of Rivers, River State, are in good health, and people of River State are so much um, protected with all this virus. I'm so much proud of him. A lot of people have been wishing, Nigerians have been wishing, if they wish he is the president of. Um, Nigeria, things would have been, um, been this coronavirus would have been reduced, reducing, wouldn't have been hearing cases of COVID 19 anywhere. Have you ever heard that in River State we have a dead case of this COVID 19? No, because he hates corruption. 
the, no, no NDDC officials that can come in to the state and ask him to pretend or to support them or to connive with them by lying that there is COVID-19 death case in this in the state never it will never succumb to that it will never accept such a lie it will never accept such a thing it will never accept such a fake life it will never it would never want to um, betray its people for no reason for money that is it I so much appreciate him is a man is a good leader this is what they call good leader he has been supporting he has been supporting his people since he became the governor i'm very much sure that if he comes back or is coming back to contest the second term as the governor of the river state i'm very much sure that rivers people will be proud or will be, pr will be very will support him will rally around him and support him in the struggle of coming back as the governor of river states that is it i stand with wiki their influx is not ordinary their plants bringing driving these people these are Maldives, away from their states. It's very fishy. It's very fishy. Why will you um, abandon your own people, driving them away from your state? What? Why not keep them in your state? If not that, there's something behind this repatriating. Mwike, the border should remain closed. But he can relax the lockdown in the states for the people of River State to go about. But the border from which anybody, Almajiri's Nautenans, can come in to the state should be totally blocked. Let their parents in River State, let their parents in um um not in the north let them send them to their parents in the north let their parents take care of them why can't parents take care of them why are they taking taking them away from their parents why are they taking them away from their parents their parents should be in a position to take care of them and not sending them from one state to another not sending them from one state to another I still stand on my ground that the next president, God will protect. The next president should be Wike Winsome if he contests. I know that. I know very sure that he will be accepted. He will be elected. He will be given that uh, opportunity to become the president in the states i'm very much sure of that god would definitely protect him for not collecting bribe from these people by sending them back to their state to their to their state and i pray that god in his infinite mercy would definitely protect him from all these calamities in our country and our state so viewers your comment is very needed. Drop your comment below the comment box. Click on the subscription button as well as the bell button to receive updates whenever I publish new videos. And don't forget, share and like this news as well. Thank you.